Hi guys. Welcome to the 4Wheel TV channel. Support US by clicking the subscribe button and pressing the notification button. Thank you. He's pre-production cars are more thinly disguised than before, giving a closer look at the Cayenne's styling tweaks. At the front of both the SUV and coupe, larger, reshaped headlights have been fitted which incorporate Porsche's quad LED running light signature, along with a slightly reprofiled front grille featuring thinner single strip indicators. The bonnet has been tweaked, too, with a pair of narrower strakes along its length, and the lower front bumper appears to have gained a set of air vents at its outer extremes. As our previous spy shots revealed, the Turbo SC hybrid model will adopt a deeper, more menacing front grille arrangement and enormous 10-piston brake calipers painted in acid green. These latest images also reveal a new multi-spoke alloy wheel design that will arrive as part of the facelift. At the rear, the Cayenne and Cayenne Coupe will receive redesigned LED tail lights and a new diffuser, with the standard SUV repositioning the number plate below the tailgate. The only other change is a tweaked lip spoiler for the coupe model. As with the current model, the facelifted Cayenne will utilize Porsche's PCM 6.0 infotainment setup, which is controlled through a 12.3-inch touchscreen. The system features connected intelligent satellite navigation, natural voice control, Android Auto and Apple CarPlay. As the most powerful SUV in Porsche's lineup, the facelifted Cayenne Turbo SE Hybrid will use a 4.0-liter twin-turbocharged V8 engine combined with an electric motor to produce 671 bhp and 770 Nm of torque. The revised car is likely to borrow the upgraded version of this powertrain as fitted to the latest Panamera Turbo SE Hybrid, which sees a boost to 690 bhp. We expect the Cayenne to be revealed early next year, alongside a revised Cayenne Coupe. 